Well, it's the start of day 10. I did say I'd have a lovely view of where HS2 is going to go in the morning. And there it is. Let's get moving. A bit breezy. We'll see how it goes. Mm, I think good weather. Good weather. Evie, what have you been rolling in? Oh, bloody hell. You're not getting in the tent tonight like that, you know. Hmm. Well, this is Howell Wood. One of the uh, woodlands, obviously, that HS2 want to commit to tree Mageddon in. Uh, it is an ancient woodland. It uh, goes, HS2 will go through, yeah, over there, through here. Leave a big old scar, you know, like HS2 does. Um, had a bit of trouble getting in here. There were three coppers hanging around looking for someone else. Took remarkably long amount of time for them to be convinced that I wasn't him, whoever he was. And it took a remarkable, you know, I lost about 10 minutes, quarter of an hour there. And uh, quite disappointed how many times, how many attempts it took them to spell Rukin right. Come on, it's five letters, guys. You know, I, I, I've read them out. I, I even did it. I even, I even did it in the no NATO alphabet, and still didn't get it right. Um, big news today. Well, big news uh, is that the government are set to admit that HS2 is not going to cost 55.7 billion quid. Yeah, big news flash, really. Known that for God knows ever. Um, but of course, the question is, how long? have people known that it's not 55.7 because Boris Johnson himself a couple of weeks ago said it's probably be 100 and uh, when Alan Cook the new chairman came up with this 70 85 billion number it seems that number was about three years old and if that number is about three years old someone should be seriously in the car because you know as various MPs and Lords have said it would suggest that Parliament been misled. Uh, oh no, you're not getting out yet. You ain't clean yet, mutt. And that was all the time I had for filming on day 10. Um, I just wanted to bomb it. I went that fast that by the time they, uh, the Crofton Action Group sent the tweet saying, there's a point waiting for you in Crofton, I'd already passed Crofton. I just wanted to make sure that by the time it got to the next day, I had a nice leisurely stroll into Leeds, and I'm that close to Leeds, I can smell it. Uh, yeah, that's that's what yesterday was about, as much as anything, just getting here. I have to thank the the staff at the, the, the plough in Warmfield, because they gave me food a half an hour after they'd stopped serving food, which bear in mind I hadn't had a, a meal since uh, breakfast the day before was very welcome I had been running on empty and uh, yeah I managed to stagger myself here to uh, bottom boat and uh, then it's it's on to Leeds so sorry won't be doing the spur to Church Fenton and uh, sorry Church Fenton and Swillington I, I know you've been very supportive of me in the past I am just doing the main line uh, the other issue is getting there and then having to come back and I didn't do it with Chesterfield either and you know, I've still got more to do. <laughs> Why am I just grinning at the screen? I don't know what to do now. Evie, turn the camera off. Useless dog. <laughs>